What's up, FOA Squad? I'm Anthony, and welcome to our channel, Life with Anthony. I hope you guys are doing well out there. Happy Tuesday to you guys. Uh, I'm sporting one of my new hats. This is the what I thought was black, but it looks to be like a dark blue when I look at it close in the light. And I also have a red one that I showed you guys back in my hotel uh, video. But guess what, guys? If you are a part of the community page, you already know this wonderful, wonderful news. I got the permanent spot here at this campground. Yay! I was so happy when they came up to me and uh, offered me a site. Uh, I was at dinner and I was in line because they had the potluck on Saturday. I was in line and the guy that actually told me that I was number two on the list, he came over to me and said, um, so-and-so was looking for you. I won't say their name. So-and-so was looking for you and uh, all day. Uh, I think you got the spot. And I was like, okay, good. Look, I had the audacity to go. I don't know why I do this, y'all. Why do I do this? Tell me, tell me, FOAs, why do I do this? And this is not the first time. Why do I go to the potluck with no teeth in my mouth? And people, um, I'm meeting people left and right and, and no teeth in my mouth. I did that at another potluck here uh, last year. <laughs> Anywho, he came over and told me that I um, that so-and-so was looking for me. And then when I got my food and sat down and was eating, so-and-so came over and said, um, when you finish dinner, um, I want to take you somewhere, take a ride with me. I said, okay. And so I finished dinner and he and I got on the golf cart and he drove me to the site. And as we were driving to the site, he said, um, we have a site that's available that's open. It's uh, site 46 and it's a nice site. And he was, you know, talking about the site, which I already knew and had already gone and looked at the site, as you guys know, because I put a short video clip of it in one of the videos. But anywho, I got the permanent site. Now, 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 I will finally have a place that I know that I can come back to once I get off the road. Ah, uh, this is so exciting. I was so excited. It almost felt surreal. And, and then as I started thinking about it and I was processing it and stuff, I was like, okay, now I want to do this, now I want to do that. But I'm super excited, super excited. And guess what? It could not have come at a... This is getting on my nerves, this little white stuff here. I shaved this morning, but I didn't shave my mustache because it didn't look like it needed. All right, that looks like it's gone. Yeah. It couldn't have come at a better time because guess where I am going today, Sunday. Okay, by the way, I know it's Tuesday, but I recorded this video on Sunday. Guess where I am going? I am going to the RV show in uh, Fort Myers, Florida. It's about an hour away. And getting that permanent spot, learning that I got a permanent spot now, it kind of change my thought process as to what my next uh, home is going to be like. And I, now I'm considering, okay, Anthony, come on. I know you're excited, but let, let's talk, right? <laughs> now, okay, I got water. I, what? Oh my God, I'm crying. <laughs> oh my God, this news was still... <laughs> but anyway, yeah. Now I am actually considering class C's, something that I can, that's much bigger that I can sit on that site, put on a site, and I can actually drive off with it uh, if I want to and go someplace else. Or I will also have the option of, you know, tent camping at other campgrounds when I go. I got all kinds of tent, uh, tent gear and everything, so I might just leave for now, it'll be this trailer. Leave the trailer here and just take my car and do tent camping at the other campgrounds because I won't be staying there for like months at a time now. I'll be staying there for maybe two weeks and then come back here and then, you know, in a month or so, go out again or travel. So 
this is so so exciting i'm telling you now i mean and i'm going to start working on becoming a florida resident as well i may try to get all that stuff in order in the next month or so but i'm telling you now guys this is so i'm, I'm just i'm overwhelmed by it with whoo yes but anywho i am dressed showered shaved and now i am heading to the uh RV show in Fort Myers, Florida. I'm going to pay attention to uh, a little bit more close, a little closer attention to the Class C's now. And if they have a lot of travel trailers there, I'm going to pay attention to that as well. But enough rambling. Let's head to the RV show. Yes. Yes. <clears throat> Okay, guys, I am here at the Lee Civic Center in Fort Myers, Florida. I'm kind of looking around, and not a lot of folks here so far, which is good. It opens in 10 minutes, but I see people uh, walking over there, so I'm going to go ahead and head in. This is probably the perfect timing because it's not going to be that many people there, and I should be able to just film 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 away film away all right guys see you guys inside all right guys this is the chateau let's start right with it oh got a dinette set i see a dinette already look at that all righty got some cabinetry up top Look at this. This is pretty good. No counter space whatsoever. They do have a an extension right there. I'm not even gonna lift that up because I learned my lesson. Has a microwave here, and this is discounted 49, almost 50 grand. Oh my goodness. Look at this huge refrigerator. Which way does this open? Okay. Here's the bedroom. Let's look at the, here's the bathroom. Oh, I like that little shower. It's pretty neat. It's nice. Here's the bedroom. You can put a TV right there. It has the hookup for it. Couple covers up top. This is nice. Oh, look at this, y'all. They have some cupboards in the big drawer there. See, this is what I'm talking about. You know, this right here. The only thing now is not that much counter space, but I could prep on a table and up there, nice TV right there. Cause I wouldn't, of course, I would not sleep up there. So I would be able to definitely sit right here and watch TV. Oh, wow. This All is right, nice. let's, let's look at this one. This is on a Ford Transit. This is the Gemini all wheel drive. Okay. Not understanding what's happening here. <laughs> Cause they look at the bed. What's happening with the bed there? I think these size uh RVs are not gonna have that much counter space. I don't like this one though. I'm I'm about to head on out of here. This I don't like this one. Do they have the price on it? They only had the price. Yes, I think it's on the outside. Let's check out this one. This is the Integra. 84 grand. See, this is what I'm talking about. Oops, excuse me. Let's check this one out. 84 grand. 
Wow, I like this Donette set. Once again, no uh, counter space, nor an extension in here. But look at, look at the way this looks. I love this dark color. Oh, wow. Love the backsplash. And I like this cooktop better so far. Yes, I like this better. This is just like the one I have. Hood range there. And, and they go ahead with your bad self a double sink. Wash and dry. <laughs> yeah, they got a lot of cupboards and stuff down there. Oh, wow. This one is so far. Look at these big cupboards here. What? That ain't no... Oh, that's a fake out. <laughs> I mean, what can you put up in here? Oh, my heavens. Stop that. I'm thinking, what's... Now, why won't that go back? I think it's because they got maybe a cupboard in the uh, bedroom. Look how much food I can put up in here. My goodness. Okay, I can't open that one. This is the bedroom. Oh, I like the headboard. All righty. Like the headboard. Okay, they don't have a TV hookup available in here. Nice headboard. Let's check out the bathroom. Okay, fancy, fancy there. <laughs> Look at the fancy shower door. <laughs> Ooh, that's what I'm talking about. Look at that. <laughs> Look at that fancy, fancy there, boy. I definitely will be moving up like the Jeffersons. All righty. Here's the TV out here. I like this one. Oh, let me shut the bathroom door. Yeah, this one. I gotta write this one down on my short list. All right, I'm still at the Odyssey Integra SE because I just noticed that they have a generator there and I didn't even notice that it was a slide out when I was an inside. So, that's some added stuff for the Odyssey Integra SE. All right, guys, I am indoors now, and this is the Compass all-wheel drive. It's a 2023 pre-owned, 89.98. Let's have a look at this. It's on a Ford Transit EcoBoost all-wheel drive. All right, I'm just gonna stay right here. I'm not gonna go all the way in because I'll just give you guys a full. This one does have a counter extension. I don't like this one, so let's move on. Here's a 2022. This is a Solera. Oh no, this is too big. I wouldn't want this one. All right, let's see what else is interesting here. Here's a small one. This is a Forster by Forster River. This is a pre-owned 2023. Not opposed of a used one at all. All right, let's step up in here. Okay. Love, love the dinette. The table look a little wobbly, but nice floors. Countertop extension. I kind of like the decor of this one. I am assuming that this is, this can't be a slide out. If it is, no, I don't think this is a slide out. This is the first one I thought that has the TV in the bedroom already and another television 
over there. Let's see what the bathroom looks like. You can walk around the bed. There's space to walk around the bed. Okay, I don't know. Okay, oh, this is to... Oh, okay, you can go ahead and... Okay, don't move that E. Ooh, let me stop before I break something. You break it, you buy it. Not at 94 grand, I won't. All right, this bathroom is okay. A little sink there, toilet. I do like the shower. I hope the door works better than this thing here. I wish the bedroom was a little more modern, like a headboard. They got plenty of cabinetry over there, but now let's move on to another one. This one here is the Vida. This is 109. 2024 let's take a look oh wow this is different okay they got lounge chairs no dining chair this has got to be a slide out i think because this big up in here boy double sink oh wow this is pretty nice Nice bed. This has got to be a slide out. I'm gonna check when I go out. Cause this thing is huge. <laughs> it feels big. There is the sink. Shower, I should say. All the bathroom so far looks similar. But this one has a little bit of counter sp space right here. Couple plugs. Look, I'm telling you, buy your RV at an RV show. Look at that, discounted, 75 grand. Jimmy, crack corn. But of course I don't like this one because it doesn't have a dinette. Let's take a look at this one straight ahead. This is 22T. It's the Condor. Oh Lord, this is little. I haven't even gotten up in here yet and I feel claustrophobic. TV. Oh wow, this has got to be a slide out because this is, where is the, um... okay, they don't even have a sink in here. I mean, um, a cooktop. What in a hoot nanny? Oh, this is a little thing right here, boy. Oh my heavens. This remind me of a class B. Look at this little teeny, look at that little tiny refrigerator. Oh my goodness. Oh my God, you gotta jump up on the bed. <laughs> you gotta jump up on the bed. Oh my gosh. Oh, I don't even know what to make of this. I don't like this one. This gotta be a, a, a a dry bath, I mean a wet bath. Yeah, this is a wet bath. Oh no. I'd be going backwards if I get this one. All right, let's keep it on. This is one of my favorite ones. I looked at this one outside, the Odyssey Integra SE. Big dinette set. I like the decor of this one, the dark wood. Nice kitchen, no countertop or counter space, no extension. Love the double sink, wash and rinse. Two burner cooktop, much like the one I have already in my trailer hood roof there. I think that's what it's called. Microwave. 79 grand. 80 grand. Have a 
Okay, I can't open this. Okay, there we go. Nice size refrigerator. Love the backsplash. Separate freezer. And it's pretty big too. Ooh, all that air came out of there. That's nice. Nice bathroom. Even have a toilet paper holder, which I don't remember seeing in many of the other ones. Nice, nice shower. Man. Let's try this shower out. Oh, wow. This shower is huge. Oh my gosh, look at this. This shower is huge, huge. Has a towel rack right there to hang your towel. Not the best shower door. Not the best one, but it will work. Wow, this is pretty, pretty. It's very shallow in here. But you probably can put your mouthwash and uh, toothpaste and all that stuff in there. All right, let's take a look at some of these big, big ones. <laughs> Even though I'm not interested in them. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is like a house. <laughs> this is like a house. And look at that, $274,000. Oh my gosh. This is like a house. And that's a slide out right there, I think. Wow. <laughs> this is super big. Oh my gosh. Look at this one. It's $329,000. Let's see what $329,000 gets you. Oh, okay. All righty. Oh, look at the floors. Yes, two. We sign it if we need to. This has a this has a, a bunk bed. Jimmy crack corn. Here's the bedroom. The bathroom. Oh my heavens. If I pay this much for anything like this. You best to believe I'm going to be parked somewhere living in it full time. <laughs> I would definitely not spend this kind of money for uh, weekend travels here and there, whatnot. Oh, no. I love the floor. It looks slippery, though. Look like you can bust your behind up in here. Look at a huge television. Oh, my gosh. No way. And look at this cockpit here. Good gracious, they got a television up there too. Look at the cockpit. I can't even see myself driving that. My legs probably not even long enough. Let's take a look at one more and then I'm going to be leaving. All right, let's take a look at this Allegro bus here. And then we'll take a look at that Tiffin there, that big one. Okay, it's dark in here. All right, we're gonna leave this one. <laughs> All right, someone is in that one. So. A lot more people showed up now. Okay. Wow, 
was there. This is definitely for a family, a big family. But they only have one bed. Okay, does this bed pull out? Because it looks kind of short. Adventures. Man, nice bathroom. Really, really nice bathroom. All right, guys, I am done at the RV show. Um, they had just about the same uh, types of uh, mobile homes and RVs and everything that the one in Daytona Beach that I went to. Um, since I am now possibly interested in a Class C, they did have uh, a few of those there, but there were about three Class Cs that I, I liked I like the price. They was well under um, $100,000, but just something to consider. I'm going to get back to the uh, campground and get on YouTube and look them up individually and get some more information about them, but definitely was worth coming here. And I would definitely say if those prices are true to what they have in there, I would definitely purchase something from an RV show and uh because they were heavily discounted i don't know what's going on with my mustache but they were heavily discounted all right guys i'm gonna head back to the campground right now i got about less than an hour drive and i'll see you guys a little later on in the day